Love and Light, my Jamaican family. Love and Light, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to Protecting JA. Uh, today we're going to we're going to talk a little bit on this new development in the KSAMC. Isn't it mysterious and curious that the PMP attempted in the council to operate as if they won outright and they are fully in charge isn't it a little bit curious that after the mayor the, the former mayor now the deputy mayor wrote to the mayor in regards to him dismantling committees and want to re-establish the committees with majority PMP members having not won outrightly it's a it's a divide in there it's a it's a, 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 a draw 2020 on both sides 20 on each side isn't it curious that after the former mayor who is now the deputy mayor wrote to the mayor about there is shenanigans and his attempt to do something that is technically illegal there is a request for audit the first image you saw in this uh, video is Venetia Phillips the first time I've seen her comment on anything since the local government election it's as if it's a laughing matter isn't it curious isn't it curious that hours after the JLP candidate for the Kintyre division is featured in one of the leading newspapers Gleaner that he will be going to court because of irregularities in the election just concluded that the PMP's Dennis Garden I think his name is is requesting audit of alleged 88 million overspend on salaries isn't it curious hours later isn't it curious to you out there as observers of our democracy isn't it isn't it curious that a few hours after G2K the youth arm of the JLP released a, a statement made a press release in regards to the mayor's first test and him having failed his first test whereby carnival just ended and the streets are all filthy and messy he didn't he seemed to not have had an handle on things so the entire city is messy isn't it curious that after all these public comments that the new PMP leadership is requesting an audit is a sham audit and I am sure that this audit is going to show nothing much and let me say it here if it is that some bandula go on with the former JLP administration in the council then heads must roll yeah man heads must roll because if a some bandulu business man fell up a prison from the former JLP um, administration but if it is that it would have been an easy understanding that with the new reclassification or the new classification of salaries 
then common sense should say that if people's salaries are moved up almost the middle of the year around about april last year down to about june july then there would be a difference in on the books as it relates to what the salaries were before and what the budget for salaries were before as to what they are now but it is rather curious that after some of the first test simple test too for the new leadership of the KSAMC after the first set of tests were failed simple test clean up garbage and all of that we see even yesterday fire burned down a river tan ah, let me look at something there if after a few weeks and the first set of tests of leadership are failed because you see people need to understand you know that when the JLP is in power the citizens ourselves set a higher standard for the JLP we don't really set no standard for PMP you know so I know it's kind of difficult now that the PMP leadership come into the KSMC and the standard is so high that they can't follow it well I am watching and I guess we will see what come out of this audit but the audit will not take away from the issues and the situations that are bound in both Papine and Kintyre the PMP spent over 150 million dollars I heard it is alleged in Papine they spent that on Venetia over 150 million they spent to get out Venetia and down in Kintyre shenanigans with the polling stations all of a sudden polling station must change and go yes I have to go yes and this that that one bag of last minute and there might be a rerun in the Kintyre division so it is all there to be seen and as one famous radio broadcaster always say we will see it it's coming it's like pregnancy if it's there you will see cause it'll come <laughs> anyway what good my jamaican family take care of yourselves and thank you again for tuning in please remember to subscribe to those of you who watch but haven't yet subscribed um give the vid give the videos a thumbs up that little thumbs up button that you see below the video about three or four steps below each video give it a thumbs up and you can comment in the comment section i want to hear your views yes man i'll read through as many as i can and i will make sure i mention some of those comments in upcoming videos thanks again please remember to please remember to subscribe and see you again take care